Have you ever wondered what it's like to run max toughness on Connie? No. No? No. No? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Then that's because your brain's small, my brain bigger and smoother. Toughness Connie can be seen as a troll build, but bear with me whilst I talk you through the build itself. For my abilities, I am using decreased stamina cost, shorter debuff duration, and no stamina cost. Make sure you use no stamina cost now that Choose Flight and Stamina has taken a massive hit. Otherwise, don't come crying to me when you pop a lock using your ability and then Johnny's dry humping your leg because you have no stamina. Come on, guys. You need to think harder, not smarter. Moving on to our perks. I am using tougher stuff so that my toughness is increased by seven. Tougher stuff will allow us to reach a max toughness, which will actually catch out a lot of family members, including myself. You run into Connie and you think, oh, she's such an easy, frail ginger target that nope. I can beat down. And then she takes a creamy overhead leather face smack to the chin, two Johnny hits, and she just brushes it off like it's nothing. People will target you because you're Connie. So why don't you just use that max out toughness and be two and a half times stronger than base Connie? Harder, not smarter. For my second perk, I'm using jump start so that our stamina consumption on dashing is reduced by 50%. And our final perk is, of course, extra drip. And extra drip is completely broken on this build, as it is on any build. Say you're on 15% health after Johnny has smacked you about 20 times and you're still not dead and he's really struggled to get you to that health. Then that's no worries for you. All you need to do is take one sip of your slurp juice and you're back to full health and can pester Johnny more till he quits. Also, just remember you are Connie, so you can always just run straight up to a door and pop the lock immediately off of it. Not only that, you also have 35 base proficiency, which means if you can't pop a lock off straight away, you can get through a door very, very quickly. And with max toughness, you can just be a lot more careless in how you go for the doors or whether you decide to go for the fuse or valve. Or if you're feeling like an extra charge, you can kick off that generator with the 15 strength that you have. <laughs> how admirable. <laughs> For my attributes, I am using 23 into toughness and 8 into endurance. And lastly, here is my skill tree. If you follow the right, you will eventually meet tougher stuff. With a little bit above it, you'll meet jump start. And then all the way back to the middle again, you will meet extra drip. Don't quote me, but I think jump start is a random perk. I'm not entirely sure though, but actually there's one way to test this. Okay, so jump start is in fact a random perk. <laughs> I can't imagine you'll spend much time re-rolling as you have two random nodes that you can obtain it from, so. Well, that's all from me. Please like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the Max Toughness Connie gameplay. Your, your condition oh, no. is deteriorating. You must escape. Escapade. Of course I'm going to escape. Let's go. We're playing as Connie, and we are in on the Samora House, one of my favorite maps recently. It's a map that doesn't show up very often, and I very much appreciate that. Right, we're using Max Toughness as well. We're using Max Proficiency. We're going to see if we can escape escapade the family but with the max toughness you can just distract go for the fuse and valve with no real issue no real hassle can we get one bar on this before leather boy opens the door is he gonna chainsaw the door no nope, i can't hear him okay yeah look at this the base proficiency wow. look how quick we get this door done uh, boom 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 we're basically out that is it's so good it really is so so good uh connie can the, 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 the fact that connie's able to run max toughness and have such high proficiency is just beyond me. It really is. Uh, since, since Grandpa's been waking up, woken up, I'm gonna go up here. I should have ran a bit further out and then ran the corner. It's a very bad position to sit. Nice. No one's died early, which is amazing. Uh oh. We'll go and open this if we can. Uh oh. What? Oh. Okay. You over me. But look at this, look at this, look at this. We got max toughness, baby. We got max toughness. We would not have been able to tank that hit without max toughness. I'm just being completely transparent with you. Lovely. We just tanked one of Leatherface's overheads. He may be using Scout and may not have had his perks ready, but... Oh, wow. This is so bad for them, actually. We can just use Focus to get in here. Nice. Look at that. Yeah, with max toughness, we might have even bled out there to... without, without max toughness. There's so many health potions in here, by the way. All right, let's go pour this bad boy on ourselves so we have max health again. We can take another overhead from Leatherface. We may not always be able to do that, though, because obviously if he gets if he has Violent online and he manages to overhead us, we could be screwed. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and grab another tool pick. Lovely. We don't necessarily need another tool pick, but I'm going to grab one anyway. The boy himself is, is opened the door. 
Hopefully he won't see us here. He'll go around. Yes, nice, nice, nice. And then we can just head back in. Oh, you won't expect this. There's no way he'll expect this. <laughs> oh my god, Hitchhiker could, could expect it though. Hey, leave me alone. Please. I'm innocent. I'm innocent, please. <laughs> There's not much Hitchhiker can do here. He can try to chase me as much as he wants. That grate isn't open, so we need to get through this quickly. And he's going to chase us through. And then now we've just made an infinite loop. He'll hit us once here, maybe. No? Okay. <laughs> this loop, he can't get me unless he has two people. And I have max toughness. So even if he manages to get a few hits on me, it won't matter. Is there a trap there? Doesn't look like there's a trap there. Oh, oh no, I could be so wrong. Oh, no, that's not. That is not smart. Oh, my God. This isn't even locked either. Oh, has someone managed to pop, pop one of Cook's padlocks? I don't think so. I don't even know whether he padlocked this door or not. He might be waiting to padlock the doors. Who knows? But with Max Toughness, I wouldn't even be bothered standing here with Johnny around me. I I usually would be concerned with low health, but this is so it's so easy to do this. Oh, he's trapped that, but not this. I'll tell you what I could do. There's, there is a little... There is some boat... Oh, my God. Someone done nope. the door. Oh, he left the door open. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Did he just want to get in the map that desperately? <laughs> the eleven grandpa, right? I ain't gonna lie. Since we've got the risky, oh no, that's not good for the family. That is, that really isn't good for the family. I know we can just escape, but we want to try and get as many people out as possible here. Ideally, let's go disable this bad boy trap. You think this is a party? Right, Lever Boy's going to go to that exit. So that gives us time to do the fuse, yes. And more often than not, there's a fuse in a lovely position over here. I never walk through this bit of bush just here, by the way. Because Hitchhiker can trap that and it screws you over massively. It sets you behind. There is usually, more often than not, a fuse to my left just here. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Mm. We're able to do these confident plays like this because we have the higher toughness, right? Don't tell me Anna's bringing the heat with her. That'd be a bit crazy. Nice. We do that one just there. That one just there. And then that's 10 as well. Six and four, you say. <laughs> but my mathematics is getting so much better since playing this game. It's kind of crazy. Right. I think one person escaped. Anna might escape as well. I don't know if she'll make it, but we can give her some sort of security. Wow. Okay. There's a, there's a valve up there. We'll go grab the valve and turn the valve on too. We're going to try and like make it every area pressured. So like in case someone... That is not how you climb a ladder. <laughs> What? I got like the... <laughs> what was that? What was that? I miss having family focus on, you know. Obviously, I can't have it on due to my... Uh, due to me being uh, a victim. But <laughs> I miss having... I miss you being able to use it. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Is that is for Maria. Oh, my God. Hitchies. Hitchies on her. Mm, yeah, let's go. We'll go ahead and call through here. Hitch... The cook will probably go turn that off. Be smart, he'll have to. We'll go ahead and close this bad boy door. Oosh. Oh my god. <laughs> we do so much to these guys. I feel so bad. <laughs> uh, the cook might have even padlocked the... What's the jiggy? The slaughterhouse gates. You never know. I refuse to move from this. I'm sorry. They can hear that, by the way. Family can actually hear you when you close the toolbox. So he 100% knows that it closed. He should have been, should have known that that closed. But he didn't. Fair enough. And we're applying so much pressure in so many different areas. It's cool. Now, what Leatherface won't check is this area here. No one checks this area here. Oh, he's just destroying stuff there. Okay. We'll turn on the valve again. Let's go. They're not, they're not seeming to bother about the valve. Okay. Yeah, there's a bones. There's a bones trapped us there. Okay. Nice. Okay, he's destroyed. That's perfect timing. He's destroying it. Let's crouch from the the chicken. You can speed walk past this chicken, by the way. Speed crouch past it. So just bear that in mind. Come on. Make it, please. Yes. Being stealthy in this game is so important. If you get caught, then more often than not, you're just you're going to reset all the progress you just made on the doors or reset all the progress you spent get, getting there. So getting caught is just not ideal. Look at this. We can do gates. Like, it, say we want to pressure the valve. We can do that. Say we want to pressure gates. We can do that. We're like a jack of all trades almost. Should I just go for it? I don't think Leatherface could one-tap me. 
Oh my god, that is crazy. We have... Uh, we should be able to do this, maybe. Oh, can we, can we potentially do this? We gave uh, so much assistance to the people to help them escape. <laughs> They're just spectating us. Let's go. Yeah, we gave so much assistance because obviously someone turned off the generator, but then I opened the fuse box for him. I turned on the valve to make to draw people away from these other areas. So I gave a lot of people a, a lot of different opportunities to escape if they wanted to. There you go. Let's go. Entire battery side is done. Now it's just to get that Anna around. Come on, Anna. You got this. You can make it. Oh, yeah. She's out. <laughs> That's where the first person escaped from, I think, in the generator side. That's the GG's. I'm going to run out here. Let's go. Well played. Really well played. All right, let's go. We're playing Corn Dog, and we are in on the family house. Let's see if what, whether, whether or not we can escape this. I've been very, very excited to play Connie. It's been such a long time since I've played Connie. It's unreal. Oh, they don't have a cook this game? Wait, that's so bad for them, though. No? Oh, <laughs> wait, did she? Wait, wait, wait. You're going to make me <laughs> act up. <laughs> she got slammed. I should have slammed. I should have slammed him. I should have slammed him 100%. That would have been so funny. <laughs> Look at everyone. What is everyone doing? <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 no. Who's going to slam who? It's a 2v2 here. <laughs> oh, no. That poor man. <laughs> oh, Sonny, no. Get up, Sonny. <laughs> I honestly love the community for this game. They're so, so awesome. They're so good. But you guys are honestly so funny. You really are. But yeah, uh, we're running Max Toughness Connie. And uh, the reason why is because you just buff her strength like that. You'll be able to tank a bunch of hits and you already have high proficiency as well. So you can undo gates and undo doors. Whilst also not being afraid to take a few hits and tank for people. You could also run a bone scrap and just fight to fight a family, family member. And win with your high toughness relatively quickly with this build too. So you're sort of like a jack of all trades by using this build. It's great. Really is amazing. Man, I hate it when there's no toolbox in that position. That's so frustrating. This is super bad for them. Because if hitchhikers... I'm going to take a little peek to see if there's a hitchhiker trap on the back door. There should be because there's no cook. And if there's not, then they're really not doing themselves any favors. Okay. Let me go and grab another tool pick and air. A bone shard. Come on, oh, this, oh, look at this broom. The kennels is amazing. Look at these two items up. Doesn't always spawn here, obviously, but wow. Ugh. If there's no trap, then we have a bone shard to fight with, and we've got max toughness, so we can win a lot easier. We can win those fights better. Let's go upstairs. Come on, come on. Let's head up the stairs. Suction straight into that door. Hopefully, Hitchhiker's not a part trap on the back bit here. What you can do is always lock these doors or latch them like this. So then people can't come and distract you when you're doing those doors. Look at that. He did put a trap here. However, it ain't going to matter because I can easily just boost this. Hopefully it's not Johnny open bashing those doors in because I will get screwed. Right, let's go and open this ba bad boy just here. It's kind of bad to open this because Hitchhiker can always just follow you out, follow after you. But right, let's use our ability to open this bit as well. Nice. I don't think anyone's barging up with those doors at all. <laughs> That's crazy. I'll tell you what. Let us go ahead and see where this generator is. Because we've opened the back door, the back, the back door or whatnot, they may think that we're going to go for battery. But in actual fact, we're going to kind of turn that bad boy generator off. Why not? You could also jump out the window with this build as well. And you won't take that much damage. Look, look he's just about... Oh, yeah, hey, look, back. He went about the, at the back door just there. We see that. And that gives us plenty of time to just turn off this Yenadator. Let's go, baby. We have such low strength. No. <laughs> oh, my God. No way. If I could turn this off, we could actually probably escape. I don't know who that was. Maybe Arna. I can't imagine anyone else would be that psychopathic. Oh, and the gates open. The back exit gate. Oh, let's go. The basement exit. We will grab this bone scrap just here. If you guys didn't know there's bone scraps that spawn here, really, really useful to take a couple of these. Because you can then fight people that come towards you. And trust me, you want to be fighting people. Because if they catch you off guard like this, Johnny can easily kill me if I'm in the open. Oh, <laughs> like Anna. Go on, Anna. Beat him up. Don't mm. Nice. Wow. Suck a oh, that poor guy. That poor, poor man. Oh, GG's anyway. GG's. Come on, come on. Well, let's go to the next one. Let's go, let's go. 
<laughs> Let's go, Connie. Wait, who just spawned in next to me? Where? Hello, friends. Where? This is us. Leland? Okay. Huh? Wait, the camera zoomed us there with straight. What? Uh, Leland? Yeah? I'm back. Oh, there you go. The man's fully functional. All right. You may be really concerned there, buddy. Actually, no one else has woken up, Grandpa, so let's not be too rambunctious and too loud. We're going to just... I think it's better just to cool it down, to be honest, just to not not smash that button and alert the whole family. Who have we got? we got Johnny Hitchhiker and Leather Boy. Leatherface, let's go. That's a good combo. I like playing against Leatherfaces because you, you start to play against them more frequently now, which is nice. Ever since they've done uh, the, the small, like... The small buffs to him. It's, it's good. It's quite refreshing. Anyway, we're using Connie. We're going to be using Max Toughness. Max Toughness Connie? J James, what, what are you doing? Max Toughness Connie is probably one of the best Connie builds you could use because she has innately high proficiency. Her proficiency is... Base stat, her proficiency is 35. T just take that into consideration. How insane is that? It's the highest out of all the victims. I'm pretty sure Julie's is 30. Um, Sonny's is 25, 30, I think. Something like that. But she has the highest, which means you don't need to really buff that stat. That stat is, is good just as is, you know? Um, I'll tell you what, I do not want to be undoing that door just yet. What's Leatherboy doing? Yeah, everyone's undoing the doors first. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. I'll just go and undo the doors too. It is worth... I've, I used to be the type of person that undone one door and tried to rush out. And now I just want to help other people get out. So I've, my play style has like completely changed from when I first started. I always, I always enjoy it more, getting other people out. Nine times out of ten, you need to get out yourself first though. Because if you don't create an opening where you create pressure, then other people are just going to... You're not going to be able to have that openness, being able to run around and cause pressure in other areas. And then come back for the rest, you know. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> What's happened to Leatherface? I've not seen Leatherface all game. Yeah, you'll start to see how good... Actually, it probably wasn't a good idea to get a second tool pick here. Is that Hitchhiker? Who's scraping their feet so much there? Oh, God. What I do with Hitchy is I always grab a bone scrap because some Hitchies will actually bar um, put their trap on the bridge door to the station, to the battery side on the gas station. Oh, this chicken's here, by the way. Crouch, crouch before you start climbing the ladder. It means you won't alert them. Is that Leland? That's Danny just crouching everywhere. Look at him. Genius player. Absolute genius. Oh, there's no trap there. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, Max Toffles Connie, you get like the boost the best of both worlds. Because you can. You know what? Since he's doing that, I'm gonna switch my lock pick and go do the valve. You can do the interior areas and not really worry have to worry too much about getting seen, getting caught. But like, I could run out on the open. It's fine. If I get seen, I can get chased, I can get beaten down. I'm, I'm tough, Miss Connie. I can survive. Oh, the valve's there too. Look. Where is everyone? Are they got Damn Johnny? Wait, he probably won't come through this way. Yeah, he probably won't come through that way because it's badged. Nice, okay. Because it is badged. I, don't, I, I can't imagine he'd badge that door. He's probably one that locked it, to be fair. But let's go and open this. Look at that high proficiency, the base high proficiency. You can do valve quicker. You can do fuse quicker. There's, like, so much you can do. It's crazy. Oh, I love it when Grandpa's not in the main area. It just means it's so much easier. <laughs> that hitchhiker trap is... That is... <laughs> that's, that's interesting. I'll give him that. Cutting these down is quite crucial too, by the way. Because the last thing you want to be is seen by someone like running around with a little audio cue following you. Quite brutal. Someone's turning that off. Come on, Johnny. Nice. All right, let's go. Let's turn this back on then. Uh-oh. Come on, Johnny. Don't see me. Please don't see me. Ah, oh, there you go. Come on, please try and turn it off. Try and turn it off at least. Don't bash it open, please. Oh, he didn't. Nice. Okay. He'll probably try and turn that off, and that gives me enough time to do the fuse now. I know we can barge doors open really quickly, but we might be all right. No. Nice. Grapple you, huh? I wanted to sneak attack him, but... Oh, mm, eat that, punk. And now, I'm sure that the, the valve's still turned on, but even if it's not, it's cool. Oh, please be open for the love of God. Oh my God, Hitchhiker's a genius. He put a trap there. And a trap there. Is he going to come for this direction? Oh my god, he did. Johnny. 
Johnny Dog. We can go through this little gap here. Oh, we're getting loads of people out. That's so good for us. That is honestly so good for us. All right, Johnny's going to come and try and hit me here. No, you're not. Oh, someone done, done the generator there. That's kind of cool. Okay, he'll run back around that way now. I guarantee Danny got out from the uh, battery side. I imagine he did anyway. Come on, come on. We're going to leave the gate open anyway, because if they have exterior lambs and I shut that and I want to come back through this area, it's just going to cause me hassle. <laughs> nice. That's smart. He, wanted, he needed to do that. Look at that. By doing Valve when Danny was doing his thing, it meant that we could... Uh, yeah, by doing Valve when Danny was doing the gate, it meant that we could take pressure away from him and uh, delay people realizing the gate was open. Well, like, toughness, Connie, man. I don't know what build that Johnny's running, but even Johnny's with, like, max damage, you can take quite a few hits. GG's, that was a good game. That was a quick game.